Hey guys, welcome to Anu's Hobby Lobby. In this video, I'm going to share with you all Easter special food art videos, especially the Indian dishes. So let's get started. Uh, so on a plate, I'm just taking a steamed carrot as well as on top, uh, you can add uh, a coriander leaves or uh, any green leaves of your choice. And uh, I've prepared igli here. So I have taken uh, about two to three iglis and cut into the shape of rabbit and I'm just arranging it here as shown. So igli as you all know it's a South Indian uh, breakfast dish it's very healthy and with this food art uh, I hope uh, kids will even more love it. Uh, so we are just adding some carrots and peppercorns uh, for making eyes, nose as well as uh, moustache and the mouth. So our kids breakfast with the food platter is ready and now for the snack uh, I'm taking apple uh, for making a fruit plate. So I just cut it into a round and then adding blueberries on top as eyes. You can add choice of fruits which your kids like uh, so that it will be even more creative and uh, they'll like it. So I hope you like this fruit plater for especially for Easter or even at any time you can make it. And for the next uh, breakfast or uh, evening snack. So let's start preparing uh, bread toast. So for that I'm taking one egg in a bowl, add uh, salt and pepper as per your choice. You can uh, avoid pepper uh, and it gives actually a better color and visibility if you don't add uh, pepper but later I realized uh, so for the taste you can add it and then mix it up and then in a pan once it's hot we'll add butter and then bread uh, slice in between into the rabbit shape uh, with a with any cutter and then uh, in between we'll add this uh, uh, egg mixture so if it's spreading across that's fine you can cut it later and make it into the proper shape uh, or else you can also add only the whites a white yellow so we'll just uh, have this uh, bread toast and then the next one is i uh, the middle portion I have toasted it and added the spread so that you can just have it uh, with the vegetable spread as well and the next one uh, you can also prepare like uh, with this uh, tortilla or uh, just the wheat pizza dough or any pizza dough you can cut it into this uh, rabbit shapes and uh, make it pizzas so this is another idea Since I did not have the cutters with me, especially the rabbit cutter, I have used this chocolate for making the shapes. So I have given this rabbit shape for making pizza and then we can top it up with choice of like pizza sauce, cheese and any of vegetables or just the plain cheese pizza so that kids will love it and will toast it, I mean bake it in oven and then it's done. Turn on oven for 10 to 12 minutes at 350 Fahrenheit uh, and uh, if you have multiple op options you can just use only the bake mode. So, so far I hope you enjoyed and uh, liked all the dishes which I have uh, shared and the another surprising and the last dessert dish which I am sharing is with this chocolate. So do check complete video and share it if you like. So I'm just taking any of the balls like you can use the ceramic or steel balls and the aluminium foil and uh, we'll cut it uh, based on the size of the bowl and wrap it all together 
around and make it into a bowl shape so just before this uh, we'll uh, melt the chocolate and uh, prepare like a ganache uh, using a double boiler method uh, like on stop top uh, like uh, you can boil the water and on top of it you can use a glass bowl and melt the chocolate uh, or you can use the microwave as well for like a couple of minutes so once we get this consistency we'll put it in a zip bag a ziplock bag so once we close this ziplock bag squeeze all the ganache into one edge and cut it very thin and then uh, on one bowl we'll just add this uh, ganache uh, into the stripes like different uh, directions horizontal and vertical uh, and uh, it should be very close so that close enough so that it this nest uh, will not be broken easily uh, so you can freeze this balls for like about 15 minutes and the next one i'm sharing is uh, using a garlic presser so for that uh, this ganache should be thick enough once we add the chocolate we'll just press it uh, using this garlic presser and uh, you can now make it like a nest so our beautiful nest is now ready you can uh, top it up uh, with uh, any chocolates like egg chocolates for the easter which we can get it from the store so these are the bubble gums or the chocolates which I have. I'm just adding it on top of this nest. So for the second type of nest, we are just breaking it up or demolding this uh, and uh, taking all the pieces and making like a nest and then add uh, the egg chocolates on top. So the third and last one is uh, like we demold it carefully and uh, we ensure it's not breaking it up and uh, once we demolded it we can just add all the remaining eggs so these are the three different types of nest with the eggs i hope you like this video and it's so related to the easter but uh, you can make it any time for any of the uh, theme parties if you are looking for any of the ideas with this eggs or easter so this is the perfect time to make for this uh, easter so i hope you all enjoyed watching this video the food art video especially for the kids and if you do so please do share and leave a comment if you are new to my channel please do subscribe and thank you for watching